Wednesday, students had the opportunity to discuss the topic of gender gaps at this week's Times Talk. Uh, we just talked about like gender gaps, which kind of led into a generation gap, and just kind of the issues that females face within education and the workforce, and kind of maybe how men are more stereotyped to do better in the workforce, and just how to be more open-minded about those issues. Many gender-based facts were presented at the beginning of the Times Talk, and students expressed that they enjoyed hearing the differing opinions voiced in the discussion, and also shared a few things that they learned. It was really cool to hear different opinions from different generations, since we had some professors or older persons in the room as well as some of the younger undergraduate students. The stereotypes in America from past generations that have been accepted are still being fought, they are being fought today and the younger generations are becoming more open-minded with accepting women in, in certain roles that men were usually uh, occupying. Although some students did say that there are currently inequalities between the sexes, they are also hopeful that this generation is slowly trying to close the gap. I would like to think so. I would like to think that we have a lot of people that want to and that would like to, but I can't speak outside of my own bubble. I know that's what I want to do. One thing I, I suggested today was that people should just be more open-minded and understanding that this is a new time in America that women can become welders and, women, and men can be stay-at-home fathers. I think some of us are kind of set, well, this is the way it is, but I think there are a few who are willing to make that change, and I think that the more people who step out of the the stereotypes um, are going to, you know, encourage more people to do that as well. So I think we're slowly but surely making progress. Jordan Elston, Troy, Trojan Vision News.